My mother did not have an easy journey through mortality. She received no accolades or worldly honors and did not have educational opportunities beyond high school. She contracted polio as a child, resulting in a lifetime of pain and discomfort in her left leg. As an adult, she experienced many difficult and challenging physical and financial circumstances, but was faithful to her covenants and loved the Lord. When my mother was 55, my next older sister passed away, leaving an eight-month-old baby daughter, my niece, motherless. For various reasons, Mom ended up largely raising my niece for the next 17 years, often under very trying circumstances. Yet notwithstanding these experiences, she happily and willingly served her family, neighbors, and ward members, and served as an ordinance worker in the temple for many years. During the last several years of her life, Mom suffered from a form of dementia, was often confused, and was confined to a nursing facility. Regrettably, she was alone when she passed away unexpectedly. Several months after her passing, I had a dream I have never forgotten. In my dream, I was sitting in my office at the church administration building. Mom entered the office. I knew she had come from the spirit world. I will always remember the feelings I had. She did not say anything, but she radiated a spiritual beauty that I had never before experienced and which I have difficulty describing. Her countenance and being were truly stunning. I remember saying to her mother, you are so beautiful, referencing her spiritual power and beauty. She acknowledged me again without speaking. I felt her love for me, and I knew then that she is happy and healed from her worldly cares and challenges and eagerly awaits a glorious resurrection. I know that for mom, mortality worked and that it works for us.